Peace y'all, I am ICC and today I'm going to show you how to use the NES 30 Arcade Stick by 8-Bit Doe on your PS4, PS3, Xbox One, Xbox 360, and the Nintendo Switch. The Arcade Stick does support the Nintendo Switch, but only with a firmware update. With this method I'm going to show you, you do not need to firmware update your Arcade Stick. This is for the wired method. I have heard the Bluetooth module for the Titan 2 will be out around December, but that is not set in stone, and it could change. When that comes out, I will have a new video for the wireless method. Anyways, everything you need to do this is your NES 30 arcade stick, a Titan 2, a micro USB cable, a controller that will match your console if you want to authenticate, and a USB cable that matches that controller. The first thing you will need to do is get my script on the Titan 2. So plug your Titan 2 into your PC or Mac via the probe slot on the back. You will need to download the G-Tuner software, which you can get from consoletuner.com. It supports PC and Mac. Launch it and look under Online Resources, then Input Translators. Look for my script named NES 30 Arcade Stick Correct Layout. Now drag and drop it right onto your Titan 2. Just remember which slot you used for later. Now we can take our Titan 2 over to our console, plug the micro USB cable into the back of the Titan 2 via the output port, then into the console. Plug your NES 30 Arcade Stick into input A, and then the controller that matches the console into input B. Boot up your console and wait a moment for it to power up the Titan 2. Once you see the memory slot it's on, flip it to the correct slot for the NES 30 arcade stick that you just put onto the Titan 2. So now you're pretty much ready to go, I just want to explain the layout a little bit. It's very simple. These four buttons on the far left are the main ones. If you are on PS4, you have triangle, square, circle, and X. Up here, you have the select and start buttons. Select is for the menu, and start is for the options. The rest of these are actually labeled for both Xbox and PlayStation, but for some reason, they only labeled the main four buttons for Xbox. So now, let's play some games with it. So here we are, we got the NES 30 arcade stick hooked up to the PlayStation 4, Titan 2 set up, and uh, yeah, let's test it out a little bit. It's not bad. I like it for uh, arcade games, stuff like that. That's actually why I got this. This is going to be my arcade game, my main stick. I'm not really going to use it for fighting games, but since people want to see fighting games, I've never played uh, Marvel Infinite, and I've never even played this character in the old Marvel games, so I don't even know if Dante was in Marvel's Capcom 3. I do remember Mega Man from Marvel's Capcom 2, but I don't know how much of it's going to be the same, and I didn't really play him too much in that one. I hit the wrong button, I did not want to switch characters. I 
I'm going to switch characters. Works pretty consistent to me. I can do all the moves at least that I remember. Uh oh. Yeah, that's not, I thought so. It's Chris. Oh, the shoddy. <laughs> that was kind of tight. shoot button, huh? Alright, so last little round. I see. I mean, it works. I think I've uh, played enough. So yeah, that's the NES 30 arcade stick on the PlayStation 4. Works on the PlayStation 3, Xbox One, Xbox 360, Nintendo Switch, a lot of other stuff. Whatever the, the Titan 2 works on, this will work on. So there you go. Thumbs up from ICC. Peace.